Hey guys, Lost and welcome to another Minecraft mod showcase here on the channel today. And before this video started, I really hope that I got my microphone fixed, finally. I don't know, it's really like, so what there is is like, um, I have a Blue Yeti microphone and there's like a little knob on the back of it that you just turn to up or down the frequency of the voice projecting into the microphone. And like... What happened two weeks ago was apparently, like, because I was, like, cleaning my desk and stuff, so I had to, like, take everything off it. So I guess whenever I picked up my microphone take it off my desk, it, like, I guess the knob got, I hit the knob or something, so it changed it. And I have no idea what it was set to prior to, so it took a lot of adjusting, but I think it is fixed now. Um, I'll definitely see by the end of this video if it sounds all right, and then I'm not going to touch it ever again. So uh i hope you guys enjoy how i sound because uh if i enjoy how i sound it's staying like this anyways today we have an interesting mod today and honestly these are the kind of mods that i like and you guys will soon know what i'm talking about once we get into it. you can probably see the tire tower of ores behind me you're probably like are those normal minecraft ores why do they look a little bit like brighter and more pronounced well guys i'd like to introduce you to the stone or variance mod that is correct the entire mod is called the stone or variance you can probably already guess what it's about but let's actually talk about it so as you guys know in vanilla minecraft there are new types of stone they all are considered stone we have stone we have granite we have dorite and we have andesite and i'm pretty sure i didn't look at the correct ones or yeah granite dorite andesite yeah i'm right never mind um and ever since 1.8 when these were added in uh, people were always theorizing, why don't they just have the ores match the tint of the uh, stone, since the stone is all over the place anyway. I mean, normally, for example, you fly over here for a good one, you just find stone like this, and you're kind of like, yeah, but it would be cool if it was like a, uh, if it was like a, a Dorite version. Yes, I had to actually check to see if that was the right one. So essentially, what this mod does is we're going to have to look underground to actually see it, but it kind of does this. So I replace this with this. That's really what it, what its purpose is. It makes things just look a whole lot more better in the mining world. So underground, whenever you're uh, mining for diamonds, emeralds, etc., it actually kind of looks better and it kind of blends in more. So it's kind of like you have to actually look and be like, oh, is this actually what I want and stuff? It's a little aesthetic mod, if you will. So from what I understand, nothing has changed toward in terms of like what they drop, like the drop variants. Everything is the exact same. It's just you can find the different like colored blocks worth of the ore. It all does the exact same thing. We will soon find that out ourselves. But just to show you guys in this chest right here. Oh, wait, before we go any further, guys, if you haven't done so already, hit that like button to share your support. Try this video to 10 likes. And also, if you are new to this video, try subscribe by the end of it if you enjoy the content I provide for you. Anyway. Back to what I was saying. So we open this chest right here. You will see we have the normal coal, iron, redstone, lapis, diamond, and emerald variants. But next we have the andesite models, the dorite models, and the granite models. And yes, I said granite, not granite. Did I trigger any of you? I hope I did. Anyway, um, so we're going to take this diamond pickaxe and we are actually going to mine some of these to see what it is like. And no, they have no crafting recipe. And yes, it is turning nighttime when it shouldn't be because I forgot to set the uh, commands. Anyway, first things first, let's mine up coal. So as you guys know, that's normal coal. Bam. It, it, it drops coal. But as you can probably tell, the colors are slightly different. I believe that is the mod doing it. So let's just mine up the iron, the redstone, the lapis, the the, the diamond, the, the emeralds, and the uh, redstone. Did I say redstone twice? I may have. Uh, and at any point, if you guys think that that like that like color pronunciation that you just saw there is a different mod uh let me know in the comments because like the only other mods i have installed is like optifine and stuff so i don't know if that's what made it look differently because it does look a little bit different i mean this is the modded blocks right here so i can't say they look different because i mean that's how they look although i don't understand why uh the dorite colors are more are, are brighter than like the andesite or granite but you know anyway so let's so as you can see we got one coal one diamond etc let's see if we get the exact same thing from this Yep, yep, it's looking to be the exact same drops. Yep, that's about right. Now let's mine up the uh, door, right? And I'm doing this just to pr Oh, yeah, it's okay, Blocks, you can mine. I understand, you're lagging a bit. Oh, Lapis didn't want to be mined right there. But as you guys can tell, um, I'm doing this just to prove that they all do drop the exact same variations of one another. And yes, if you use Fortune, it would do the same thing of one another. I'm just trying to show that like there really isn't a change to the uh, ore drops. It's just they, it, it makes it look a little bit better in the mining world. So this is, in case you guys are wondering, um, 
Back whenever I first was like, I guess you could say a noob to Minecraft and I didn't know much of what to do, I play on a server called Lost Islands. And on that server, by the way, if any of you in the comments ever play on that server too, let me know in the comments because I'd just be interested to know. But yeah, so the server called Lost Islands, it was a pretty good server until uh, 1.7 came around because they, I'm not going to go into detail about what happened. But anyway, uh, so what I would do on that server in my pastime is literally just mine. Like, that's the only thing I knew how to do well in Minecraft was just mine. I had very good luck at finding diamonds, emeralds, lapis, like everything. And this is before, like, 1.7 and 1.8, so they didn't have, like, the, uh, like, you know, the gold mines in the Mesa biomes and, like, the, uh, pronounced lapis. But there was the myth that, like, the jungle biomes had more lapis and gold for some reason. I forget why that was a myth. It may have been true. I have no idea. But, uh, so I played on that server and all I did was ever mine. And all I ever thought about while I was mining was... Wow, they really need to have more things to mining. This is, of course, before the, the these blocks even existed as well. So, this was actually one of the ideas I thought of, that they should just have, like, different tinted ore that does the exact same thing, but it, like, blends in with the different environments. I mean, this isn't biome-specific ore blocks. I mean, I'm sure there's a mod like that out there. But, uh, at least it's, like, stone-specific, so it can blend in. That being said, I showed you guys what everything looked like. Let me actually go underground. Let's actually go underground and see if we can actually find... Is this a nice cave right here? Or is this just a... You know, we're starting here. Let's see if we can actually find what we're talking about. What this mod actually is. And, you know what? I'm gonna need some night vision being down here. Bam. Alright, let's keep going. But, yeah, so bottom line, like, mods like this always interest me. Because it doesn't add anything different. It just makes the world look slightly better. Just like this. As you can see, it's not making anything overpowered or underpowered. It's literally just an aesthetic mod that's pleasing to the eye. Like, there, there's of the blending in of the andesite, more andesite-style blocks over there. Here's the normal stone. Well, so as you can see, it's still going to be, like, normal blocks like that. It's just whenever there's a patch of, like, andesite or something, any ore that would be there is going to be fused with it and actually blend in with it. Like, as you can see, the iron is over here. Uh, let's see if we can get a little bit lower. We are in extreme hills still, I think. Yeah, we are. So let's see if we can find some emeralds, maybe. Let's see if we can get any lower. Nope, I guess we're not going lower. Welp. Time to do what I actually did then on Lost Islands. Literally, I would go down to bedrock level and do this for hours. And this is before I was smart and I did stuff like this or stuff like this when I was mining. No, I just did this. You can imagine how much I've probably missed doing this. Like, in terms of ores, like, I mean, I was pretty good finding dungeons and whatnot, but, like, this is very... You're not going to find anything. As I'm proving right now, you're not going to find really much doing this. But, uh, that being said, here, let's head back up this way and see if we can find anything more up here. I think that was some iron that we just broke. Up here's some coal. Come on, I want to see it blending in with the blocks. There we go. There's some andesite. To be honest, I had, whenever I saw that one coal when I was giving the example at the beginning of this mod show, because I thought that the mod wasn't working, I was like, that should be fused with the andesite that's there, but it wasn't. Then again, like, oh, where even am I? Oh, I'm all the way over here. Um, but yeah, Pr pretty cool mod, pretty small mod. Uh, there's not really much else to show other than just that. I mean... What's well, more to understand, it's just a mod that makes the ore blend in with the with the uh, surrounding stone type blocks. But yeah, guys, that is going to conclude this mod show. If you did enjoy, hit that like button, show your support, subscribe channel if you are new, and the download for this mod will be linked in the description as it always is, so you can download for yourself, check it out, enjoy it, and yeah, that that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.